Hi, I'm Jim Guidis, and I'm with CJS Electric. Today, I'm going to show you how to replace a dimmer switch. First, you're going to need is a flathead screwdriver. Second, you're going to need is a voltage tester. Third, you're going to need a pair of side cutters, preferably insulated. Let's get started. First, we want to make sure that the power is turned off, and we'll go to the breaker box and turn the power off. Okay, now that we turn the power off, we want to make sure start by taking off the switch plate got a flathead screwdriver and remove the screws all right which brings us to exposed to the dimmer switch over here the simmer the dimmer switch has a combination you could either use a flathead or a Phillips I prepare I prefer using the Phillips it makes it a lot easier to unscrew it and take the screws out of them and take the top screw off pull it out and right here you'll be exposed to actually three wires three wires in there and you got you got the hot and then the switch leg and basically what you want to do is again test to make sure that the power is is completely off before touch before doing anything, we want to do that. And no reading. No reading. The power is off. All right. Two wires. We took the wire nuts off of them. Simple. Two wires come off here. Your third wire is the ground wire. It's the green wire, which is attached to the bear. Okay. And I'm going to get a new dimmer switch here. Got a new dimmer switch. It's pretty much resembles the old one we just pulled out. You want to do is start with the ground and make sure that the wires are together. And when you slip the wing nut on there, you want to make sure that you're doing it in a clockwise rotation. And snug, give it a little pull, make sure it's on. Okay. And you have two wires left over. It doesn't matter which wire goes to the dimmer switch in this single pole one in this in this particular installation. You put the two blacks together here with the with the wing nut with it, twist it in a clockwise position motion. You take the second wire, last wire there, and again you put it even with that. You take the wing nut and you put the wing nut over it. Make sure they're together and they're tight and snug. Give it a little pull, make sure that's good. Secondly, what you want to do is make sure that you tuck the wires way back into the box in here because the dimmer switch is kind of thick, so it's going to take up some room in the box. So you want to make sure all your wires are pushed way in the back so it gives you ample room to put in your dimmer switch. And that's how you change a dimmer switch. Jim Guidis, CJS Electric, thank you for watching.